welcome back to another lobby video. It is week two of Halloween update. So, cute or spooky? Time to trick or treat. Trick or treat says is back. Haunted house and furniture pack. My opinion on the trick or treat mini game coming back. Now, don't get me wrong. If you guys don't remember it, you can go back to my original video. <gasps> Happy Halloween. Participate in the neighborhood trick-or-treating by visiting your neighbor's homes. When collecting candy, you and the host get 15 candy each. No tricks. We hope your sanity stays intact. What? Sanity stays... Oh, stays intact. Um, okay, so this is trick-or-treat says. Um, if you guys don't remember, we're about... I'm about to um, refresh your memory. But my opinion on this minigame, it was... It was decent. I didn't have a problem with it. I just don't like that it's coming back. Is that how good it was? Like, I want... Every year I expect new mini games, not old ones. I'm kind of upset that there's a new one. Yeah, I, mean, I think... I hope I remember how to play this game. I really hope I remember how to play it. Okay, so. It's the Chicka Cheese Radio Yellow. Can't do remember how to play it. Okay. We can see why eight rounds. I'm usually down in the beginning, and then once it's... Like, I understand it more than that's how much. Get that. And you get 3,300 candy if you survive all eight rounds. So let's go check on the new stuff. Um, you don't even understand how much I have to farm. So basically, I got everything except for the vampire dragon. Um, I'm probably not going to get that, sadly. Okay, so this is our week two stuff. We have a new boat, like a cute little boat. We have a cute a cobra. It's like a donkey looking. I don't even know what it is, actually. We have a dire stag, which is the, like, 125,000 candy, which is crazy. The ghost dog, which I love so much. And then we have a spiky cherry stroller. Now, let's go to the neighborhood so I can show you guys the trick-or-treating stuff. If you guys are liking Halloween so far, give this video a thumbs up because, yeah. Make sure you subscribe as well for more Halloween content. Okay, so if you trick-or-treat at someone's house, you get 15 candy and the other person as well gets 15 candy oh so you can do it every house okay also if it's empty so it can only be trick-or-treated at once so someone i'm gonna get all of it and it refreshes every day every adobe day so that's fun this is a great way to farm candy by the way because it's not really like boring i'm kind of very happy that they added trick-or-treating in adopt me it's really fun and i like it how you also get the the candy as well. You get the candy if someone trick or treats at your house as well, which I actually really like. So I'm giving all these people candy. And there's a lot of houses. I think each server fits 30 people. So you can trick or treat at 30 plus houses, which is crazy. And I love that. Um, and there's new furniture packs. Um, we can go check that out. Okay, here's my home. Let's see if mine's been trick or treat. I don't think it has. I cannot trick or treat at my own house. So here's all the haunted house stuff. Uh, oh, I love the little spider water bowl thing. Haunted fridge. Oh, I love it. I think, oh, the hearse. A hearse parent bed. That's cute. Yeah, I think I might get the house, like, down the road because it's so cool. I love it. If you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, make sure you drop my Discord server, link will be down in the description, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay, let's check the neons. So we have Cutacabra, aww, Dire Stag, oh my god, that's so cool. Oh, I like that one a lot. Ghost Dog, <gasps> that was not what I was expecting. Okay, alright, 10 out of 10.